world's first energy-based weapons system that uses a laser to shoot down incoming UAVs, rockets, and more. Three and a half dollars per shot. Craft packed with explosives can be flown directly at a tank or a group of troops and they destroy when they hit the target and explode. The name comes from craft packed with explosives can be flown directly at a tank or a group of troops and they destroy when they hit the target and explode. The name comes from craft packed with explosives can be flown directly at a tank or a group of troops and they destroy when they hit the target and explode. The name comes from successfully intercepted and destroyed a range of incoming projectiles from mortars and missiles to drones. The official pointed out that is the first successfully tested system of its kind in the world and when asked affirmed that the incumbent Israeli government the official pointed out that is the first successfully tested system of its kind in the world. And when asked, affirmed that the incumbent Israeli government And yet ruggedly beautiful. A place where Abraham, Isaac and Jacob walked, where Moses and the children of Israel wandered.
rocket arsenal is the Siri. Intelligence indicates that in addition to 100,000 short-range rockets, Hezbollah now and Iranian Zilzals capable of striking 124 miles away. This rocket arsenal is the Siri. Intelligence indicates that in addition to 100,000 short-range rockets, Hezbollah now and Iranian Zilzals capable of striking 124 miles. capable of firing a 300 kilowatt laser, which is more powerful than the iron beams. The more kilowatts of power the system has, the farther the laser can strike targets, although laser makers in the U.S. and Israel told WSJ that the range of laser Bent systems and Elbit systems has proven its interception capabilities during comprehensive testing over its lengthy development cycle. Iron beam is a land-based laser air defense system a land-based system that intercepts and destroys short-range rockets and mortars. It has become a bedrock of the country's defense.